today I'm going to be giving you a closer look at this foldable backpack from Kitdyne. So this one is inexpensive. It comes in three different colors. Green, which I have here, black and blue. It's a 20 liter bag and it's made of nylon with a waterproof coating on it. So very, very thin material that's waterproof. Water just kind of slicks and rolls off of it. Um, and it's super light. So let's give you a closer look at this one. It folds up, so this little pocket right here is not an extra bag for you to throw it in. Rather, it is the front pocket of the backpack, just turned inside out, and it has a little handle. So I love these packable backpacks. They're so, so handy. Um, I have like a bin. I've slowly been buying different ones and collecting them, buying them in different colors. So I have a little bin where I store them all because they fold down so flat that it's easy for you to store them in your home they don't take up any space and then when we go on trips or something where we know like we're going to go to an amusement park where we're going we're going to need a little waterproof bag that's just tiny and lightweight to throw a few items in this is so easy to toss into a suitcase it weighs practically nothing and can flatten out really nicely takes up no space also if you're traveling um let's say for christmas or something and you're taking a whole bunch of presents with you but not coming back with quite as much so you want to have an extra bag that you can just fold up and then throw in your suitcase because you don't need to bring much home same goes when you are traveling out somewhere and you plan to be coming home with a lot of souvenirs throwing in packable bags like this is super handy so without further ado let's go ahead and unzipper this and give you a closer look. Okay, so it just unzips here and folds out. And you can see that this is the front pocket here. So that handle just tucks inside and zips closed to be just a really, really shallow front pocket. This one's really simple. There's nothing to it. There's no like pen holders or any kind of compartments in there. Just a simple pocket. Okay, and then your bag itself um, the material here is really, really thin. In comparison to some others that I've tried, it almost looks like sheer or almost see-through because it's so thin. So it does seem a little bit thinner than others. However, that being said, this one is significantly less expensive than other ones that I've tried. So for the price, you kind of can't beat it. Um, so if you just want a simple, lightweight bag... Uh, that's packable like that and you don't need all the bells and whistles and extra padding then that's good. One thing that I wish that it had was some reinforcement on the bottom. This is just a single layer right here. So that makes me think that over time putting heavy items in here that are weighing down there uh, might wear out the bag a little bit faster than if it had an extra layer of reinforcement. Um, on the back here there is a tiny little, po uh, little pocket. This is the only form of organization in the bag besides the gaping open pocket here and the front pocket up top okay and go ahead and zipper that closed it does have two zippers here in the main compartment one on the front um, the zippers are pretty simple um, they don't seem to snag which is nice um, and then you do have these two mesh pockets here for water bottles and this is nice mesh really stretchy you can hold things in there so there are extra pockets there for you to organize things it's great to carry little items um, that are convenient for you to pull out or water bottles of course on the back you have your regular strap right here and then you do have mesh lined on these shoulder pads so which is nice because it gives you a little bit of padding and it's definitely breathable so when you're carrying one of these around on a really really hot day that is nice to have that there um, and it just keeps you a little bit more comfortable The straps are adjustable and they're very easily. And this backpack is so incredibly light. Basically, the only weight that you're gonna be carrying with this is the weight of the objects that you choose to put in it. It's so light, it's like nothing. So taking this around to an amusement park or something when you just have to throw in a couple of bottles of water, some clothes, um, it's super convenient and easy. Also, if you're going out somewhere where you're hiking or something like that and you're just needing um, to carry a little pouch with you that you can connect to your belt or something. So should you go in a stream or something like that where you're going to take your overclothes off and just be in your bathing suit, that you can just unpack this, throw it in there, and then everything stays nice and dry and secure. And it's just a lightweight little backpack. Super, super simple. With the price, you really can't go wrong. And then to fold it up, all that you need to do 
is basically fold the outside so that it fits into this little square and then turn it inside out. So I fold in the sides first, tuck down the top, and tuck this part up. And then you're ready to turn it inside out and zipper close. These packable backpacks are so, so nice. This one has a little less organization, a little less to it, pretty thin material, but the price is inexpensive and the main things that you're wanting in this bag are there. So pros and cons, but definitely nice. And these things are super convenient. And look at this tiny little pouch that it folds into. Easy to store this away rather than having a huge duffel bag filled with big bags. This is just really tiny. It can slip in anywhere, in a cupboard, in a little bin. So that's been your closer look at this packable backpack from Kitdyne. And I just love these things. They're awesome.